Paul Wright. We're here to talk about the amazing new Roku Express. I cannot believe how fast this is. Not just fast from a Wi-Fi perspective, but how quickly you can get this set up and up and running with the number one TV streaming platform. That's right, it's Roku, and this is the brand new Roku Express. So I'm gonna show you really quickly what you get and how it's set up. First and foremost, you're gonna get this remote. Do not put your batteries in until you get everything set up. So if you, by mistake, do that, just get your batteries out before you do that. That's one thing you should, you should definitely do is wait before you put your batteries in. So I'm gonna take these out for purposes of the demo right here. You're going to get, this is the device. So this is the goods right here. And you can see just how small this thing is. Putting it in the palm of my hand quite literally fits in the palm of your of my hand. And you can see the front of this device, really nice and slick. You wanna make sure that is visible because your remote is going to need to connect with the front of this. But lucky for you, Roku's included some adhesive that you can put on the bottom of this, peel this off, much like a lot of adhesive to hang up stuff, and you can put it anywhere on here and make sure that it's visible after you connect this thing and get everything set up. There you go, that's the front end, and here is the back, and you can see it's got a place for your high-speed HDMI cable, which is included here in the box, as well as a place for your power, which we'll talk about, and a reset button in case you need to reset it, reconnect it, do whatever. There's a reset button, just hold it down and it resets everything. So first we're gonna talk about the power because you're gonna wanna power this up. They do give you a power cable and it plugs in one end to this. So. The other end is going to be your USB-A. They do not give you a block for that in case you want to plug that into a wall. You're gonna need that block that you put on the end of the USB-A to be able to plug that into the wall. But if you have a television set that already has USB-A input, you can use this to power that up. And that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and plug it into the side of this television as we get the setup. And now, as you can see, Boom, we're already getting powered up on the Roku Express. You see how quickly this is already? This is insane how quick this is. Speaking of quick, here we have a high-speed HDMI. Can you like how I did that little segue there? Here is an HDMI cable. We plug, obviously, one end into this, and then one end into, I'm gonna plug it into my HDMI 3 right here. We're already going quickly, aren't we? Boom, I'm gonna flip it around and look at this. We're already ready to go. Of course, I took my batteries out for purposes of this demonstration out of my remotes. I'm gonna put them back in. The other thing too that you need to realize is that you can, or you should, download the Roku a Smart app onto your iPhone or Android, iOS or Android mobile phone, and you could do things like listen wirelessly by connecting to your phone. And again, I need to have this visible with this. I don't have to have it like right smack on it, but it, here we go. We're just gonna get it started. So it's gonna look for your wireless networks. We're gonna connect to my wireless network here. I'm gonna cover this up so you can't see my passwords, but we're gonna do this really quickly. Here. Okay, now we're checking to connect and now we're connected. So we're going there. It will update your software if you need to. If you already have a Roku account, you'll need to enter the email address that you used for the account. If you don't have one set up just yet, you can easily set it up. I'm going to cover up the email address as I type it in. All right. And then it's going to send you an activation link to the email address that you sent it to. And then of course, when you click on that, it will activate it and it will send you into, here we go, activation link, boom, activating the device and then click continue. And it'll say, do you have a satellite service or cable service? And if you do, you enter that. And then you're going, it's gonna ask you what types of TV you like to enjoy, Netflix, Prime, Disney, uh, Hulu, all of that good stuff, ESPN, etc. You tell it what you like in terms of music, sports, weather, all of that good stuff. You click continue 
it will build your channels and it'll ask you, there's, hey, here's a bunch of free, other free channels we can add to. You can always add later in the app or on the Roku thing. I'm just gonna go ahead and click continue for purposes of keeping this quick. Now it's updating the channels. So it's going to, it's updating all of the channels. It's putting everything onto this little tiny device right here. And in no time, you're gonna be enjoying the number one streaming platform on the planet. One other thing too that you get is you get this cool sticker that says, I love Roku and I do. So I can't really put it on my TV right here. But anyway, you get a cool sticker that goes like that. It might be good on a laptop, something like that. But here you go, it's adding a bunch of channels. You're also going to get a quick start guide that you can look through. It says the same stuff that I'm saying, but why would you look at this when you could see how it's done? It's a much more of a visual learner than just, although I guess reading is visual, isn't it? Okay, looks like we're updating here. We're just about there. Boom, we're all done, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go, it's time to, oh, um, let's get started. Here we go, that was it. How quick was that? How awesome was that? Full HD, you're getting its fast Wi-Fi, completely ridiculously fast setup. And like I said, you want to download this Roku app, get the Roku app going, and you could do all the same kind of stuff that we just were showing, completely cater your experience to different users. You can to hook it up to where you can have your own listening so you're not bothering anybody else that might be in the room. It's really an incredible and an incredibly quick way to enjoy your number one streaming service on the planet, Roku Express. I hope this helps you. And be sure to check out the Roku channel. The more free, my ad premium.